Okay, there we go. Hello, Janet, to design your beloved Commander D. Uh, yeah, so. Moving on from drama content, right? Uh, playing the uh, next champion. I'm sure a lot of y'all are like, uh, wait a minute, isn't this the Eurostick uh, uh, right? Like, uh, champion? Aren't you a drama keeper? I'm sure a lot of y'all are like, uh, no, I am not a one of the I am not a drama tuber. I only cover drama that I feel like would benefit me. And um well, uh, I'm my own No, I am not a one of the I So Yeah, I am moving on from drama content as a whole and I, I'm just sick of it, you know, like so let's get started. Now, before you start roasting me in the comments, allow me to explain myself. I see a lot of YouTubers covering drama and all this kind of stuff, and let alone on YouTube, drama sells. Like, I I'm not gonna downplay it, all right? I never have downplayed any form of content. Right now, on all the platforms, drama sells. But there seems to be a huge tone shift. And, like, people wanting to handle drama. This huge tone shift has changed. And... It seems a lot of people are voicing out against... That which, like, hey, I'm okay with that, right? Because, like, I I'm kind of sick of handling drama myself. It's gotten to a point where, like, I really... It is so freaking redundant, right? That YouTube wants to put drama so hard. And I've grown tired of it myself. I'm grown tired of, like, covering my attackers. Like, I've done the best I could covering this, like, obviously. But it's gotten to a point where, like, I'm just, like, I'm bored. I'm bored of covering, like, my own drama. I do it so, like, nobody else getting mixed signals or anything, right? I also covered past drama, such as the, uh... Uh, well... Oh, what you call it, the... Uh, several things. I don't know what to tell y'all other than... I covered several incidences of drama from the, uh... You know what, let's just move on from it. Because I covered enough drama and like, I, I've just had it up here with drama. It's really gotten to a point where it's just drained a lot of my time and or resources, development. It's... It's been very drastically draining. I never wanted to cover drama content until I fell into drama. As I saw it a way to defend myself. N 
Now, for me to defend myself and my viewers is my responsibility, though. A lot of my attackers have taken advantage of me defending myself. They have taken advantage of it and continued the assault and the attack upon my very person. It has shown how capable I am under pressure. Though. It has served a purpose. It served a great purpose of showing that I can handle this pressure with a bit of help from my friends and they're uh, very well oh, oh very informative advice but I wish to say at this point in time it's run its course Wow! I don't have the stuff for that, but that's interesting. Unlock in progress. Hmm. Let's check up on the virtual arena. Obviously. So, yeah, I just just had it up to here with drama. Rather it be my own drama or like others drama, right? So I'm just gonna leave that to the drama tubers. And if they got if they get any information wrong, like I will autocorrect the drama tubers. So, I've wasted enough time on this. I've been in talks and calls with several individuals all day today, obviously. Right? Uh, from Ashi to Geo to my very own sister. And my sister has grown worried, so is Ashi and Geo, about, like, oh, like, how this is affecting my mental health and my physical health. As this has affected me in a negative fashion. Uh, my health at least. I just got the health report from my health doctor. And it seems like I, my blood pressure has increased at a young age. Now, this is not normal for someone of my age to have high blood pressure like this. They said it was caused by high-induced, like, obviously, stress. And the stress is caused by covering all this drama bullshit and covering my attackers constantly. As you see, I've been getting better at this. So, yeah. My blood pressure has been increasing due to stress. It's not entirely my fault while being my fault. A lot of this is due to my attackers wanting to cause somebody a lot of physical harm as they find it humorous and funny to do so.
And out. I had a good lot of Ode out, too. <laughs> One more game. So, uh, yeah. It's due to this constant level of blood pressure rise and stress that I'm just choosing to move on from drama uh, content as a whole. I have no choice at this point, and it's the right thing to do. For the sake of the my career and the live streams and all that. What I have done is block these people and reported them. I will keep reporting them until Twitter but X does something that which I don't expect much to be done. Because it's Elon Musk, right? Like Elon Musk has left this site in a literal garbage. Oh, 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 like a mistake. At first he was doing a good job, but now he's left it in a state of... I, I would have to say acid limbo. As he was doing good at first, but now it's just like falling to right. Now... Oh. I want to talk about future projects. Yeah. You know, like, in the long run, right? Because, like, I like talking about projects that are currently being put in the process and being made. As of tomorrow, there will be a live stream of YouTuber 101, Ashi will return. As the woman behind Ashi will finally do, like, oh, how do you defend yourself on Twitter slash X? As I'm not good with scripts, but Ashi is. This is when and VTuber 101 happens. It's a scripted live stream, of course. I know I'm not supposed to do this, but these are scripted lessons, obviously, for future VTubers in the industry. As I want them to be better off, of course. Dealing with these certain situations. As there's a lot of VTubers out there that don't know how to make it or like how to handle these situations. VTuber 101 was meant to be a teaching tool to teach future VTubers or card ones that are struggling how to be a more effective VTuber. This is why this series was created in the first place, right? This project is almost done with its completion as a whole. VTuber 101's lessons are almost completely done. Ah, oh, we got blown up. We got blowed up. Okay, blew it. But uh, yeah, this small series of live streams have almost met at their completion. There's a couple of lessons that have to be done. One of them is obviously VTuber 101, how to create your first model. VTuber 101, what's the best 3D tracking software? Uh, and VTuber 101, obviously how to protect yourself on Twitter slash X. These are the last three lessons of VTuber 101 that need to be released. Uh, let's see here. Ooh, yeast. 75% damage. We like damage. We like numbers. We like big numbers. Especially in games. Enemy 
need reinforcements. Reinforce this! So the last three lessons of PG 101 are on their way. These lessons are good for future content creators on this platform. Now, I want to talk about Seed uh, Next Gen Candidates series that I am animating myself, that is voiced by several individuals, from the person behind Ashi to the person behind Geo. As, yes, this is a amateur animation series. Very amateurish, because like I'm an amateur animator. I don't know how to put it in any other way, way to explain other than yes, I am an amateur animator. I do not go to animation school. I cannot. Ooh, we got blowed up again. So despite all this, yes. I do with what I have at my demand right now, what I have in my current jurisdiction of content creation capabilities. As I don't have a lot of like money or high grade equipment or employees to animate the the series, right? I, I'm not a small animation studio. I never have been. Let's go into an online match. And expecting a high-grade animation quality out of myself is fucking redundant. I am not a high-grade animator. As a matter of fact, you may as well consider me a freelance animator. I'm a freelancer, I <laughs> like to say, as far as, oh, my animation is the best. No, I know oh, it's the absolute, the like, okay? worst level of dog shit amateurish level. But I do use 3D models with 2D backgrounds. It doesn't make it bad. It doesn't make it good. Oh, wow. So we got some high-end players here. Uh, yeah. So... I do what I can with what I have. As of right now, I will admit, I missed out my chance to get the job at GameStop because I've been in calls all day, online calls with associates, and overall, like, partners, along with my sister. It's because of this I missed out the chance on getting the interview at 3 o'clock today. We were all in a talk and like we are kind of like agree from like from my physical health, from the blood pressure rising and possibly causing heart attacks to, uh, you know, all that and uh, that there's going to have to be a huge change. Right now, I will admit, as well, I have not heard anything from this uh, Loppy tonight or today. So I will uh, let y'all know if she's on her way or if like something has happened in the future. Like right now, all I know is nothing at this point in time. There's a couple of games that'll be on the way in the incoming future. One of them is the Card Shop Simulator. I want to see if I can make my own cards and put them into the game. I don't know if that's capable of doing so, or maybe it's through like some kind of mod I can do that. I can find like on Game of Uh So let's. Oh, we already got a gold, Jeff. Let's freaking go. Let's go for the gold. Oh, we got green armor. 
We got shield protection. Why are you so slow, girl? Like, this girl is so slow. Is being dainty your best thing, girl? I mean, the male all oh, starter does a lot more or a faster job than that. Wow, we actually got a lot of good junk from that chest. What do we get in that junk in that trunk? Um, junk in that trunk. Junk in that trunk. What do we get from that junk in that trunk? A lot of good shit. <laughs> so, uh, let's see. Here. Let's replace that with the shield. No. Ooh, we'll take that. Let's walk around the premises. We got that. We got that now. We got a repair kit. Dang, this chick is slow. The male character is way more built. I like travel. Okay. Let's get in that temple, right? And not that way. But, uh, yeah. Oh, I hear those gunshots. Somebody's already killing somebody in this game. I'd actually rather fall in love with this game. I really do like it. It's a fun game. I found out several VTubers have played it in the past. Like, why they fell out with it, I have no idea. But it's a fun game. Like, maybe there was some controversy with the developers? I don't know. All I can think is, like, something happened, right? Blue box. Nothing good. All right, yeah, we're gonna take the plasma pistol. We're gonna place number two with the plasma pistol, right? All right, there we go. Now, rocket pods about the land. All right, we're gonna place number three with assault rifle. Okay, there we go. We got a shotgun with a shield, we got an assault rifle, and we got a giant railgun type ordeal. This is gonna be interesting. Oh, purple armor, let's go, a purple helmet. Hell yeah. Now give me that good shit here. I hear something outside. That's for close range. It's not gonna do me any good in this fight, right? Because like this game's far range, right? So let's see. I, I don't like close range in combat in this game unless necessary. Wow, somebody's already going at it down there. Uh, one down. Another purple helmet. That helmet really looks like a shoulder pad, though. I'm going to be real. Like, game design's whack on this one. Sometimes. I guess it's a jank, but it's kind of like the funny kind of jank. It's got this game's got its own kind of like charm to it, you know. Sensor mine. Next spotted. How did Mech get in here? You know what? Never mind. 
Give it time to grow. You know what? Yeah, two. Scatter shot. Yeah, and that thing does a lot of damage. Hey, y'all wrecking up my house. Get the fuck out. Okay, so we're gonna have to make a break for this one, right? I'm gonna bring it to Yeah, it went back. So we're gonna go the opposite direction. We're getting the freak out of this place, right? Hello? Yeah, the purple chest. So the series seed next gen and uh, candidates will continue. I'm planning to very soon private Yumiko VT's overall episode. I am retconning her out of the series. Simply because I'm tired of her whiny little bullshit. Like this freaking uh, little lady has been on my heels since day one ever since like oh art of her character appeared on the series and it is freaking driving me insane and not in a good way like there's a good insane and then there's a bad insane and then there's Yumiko insane right so I literally do not want to put up with this uh, lunatic of an unhinged little brat of a woman. Like, she's not even little, she's just unhinged. Oh, no. Oi, lay off. Alright, we're bringing up the free mech. Bring on the neutron star. What the heck took that thing down? The hell? Frank, you just got pwned. Okay. So, a couple of changes are going to be new monsters have arrived. See what goodies these mechs dropped. Nope, nothing good there. Let's 
Secret Art of Frenzy. Okay. Ha! <laughs> ah, three for the price of one. Let's go. Let's do some repairs. All right, hold on. Like, let's go to the wheel of repairs. Alright, let's take a look here. Oh, well, we can't win them all. Alright, yeah, let's quit. I don't know why I chose the view, but whatever. Give us a cutscene. Bronze League won. One more game. Let's go to mission. Receive. Nice. Well, wow, nice. Season challenges. Nice. Alright. Like, there is a specific mech I want to get for gold. As I really do like its design. Hold on, like, let me find it, right? Because it. Ah! It reminded me of Gun the um, Wing, right? It's got a whole bunch of, like, machine guns and rocket pods. It's really cool looking. And I want it to be like really nice. So, yee. All right, let's see who's best this time. Batman and two nine seventeen. Best three, Jen Leafy. Ah, I'm in second place. Commander D with the most eliminations. Nice. <laughs> ah, good times. Good times. All right. So, uh, yeah. Uh, let's see here. No one chatting in multi-stream yet. That's okay. But in the long run, a lot of things are going to continue. And a couple of things are changing for the better. Uh, let's see here. Game starts in 3, 2, 1, 0... I noticed earlier, though, Grimjack's channel was hacked by SpaceX. It's not actually SpaceX. These are scammers that are haters of, like, Elon Musk content. Or, not content, just, like, business. Like, don't get me started on that. We'll be here all day. It's like... Why people gotta be like this, I don't know. 
Like, they think Elon Musk is going to do some other thing. This guy is rich as hell. And he's really not going to waste his time with small fry. Like, he never wastes his time with small fry. If these hackers think this is gonna get like Elon Musk to like do something about them, they're poorly mistaken. He's far too busy to handle like small fry. Like kinda like how I have to be these days. No longer worrying about like attackers and stuff, because they're small fries. Like, my car is attacker. That is followed by a bunch of AI hentai accounts. Definitely shows how smart my attacker is. I mean, if he wants to be followed by robots, let him be followed by Terminators, you know? Not my problem. Place that. Get that. Get that. Give on to me the hoverboard. And there's somebody outside, right? That hurts. Hey, excuse me, sir. Excuse me. You want to fight, sir? Sir. Do not finish what you can't. Do not start what you can't finish. Sir! Oh no! The healing fast. Go take a rest. Never finish what you cannot. Don't start what you can't finish. There. I stumble on my words sometimes. I am a target for best today in this oh, no. game. God dang it. That hurts. That hurts. You're trying to challenge me. Big mistake, fella. Man, a lot of people are gunning for me today. Ooh, rainstorm. Okay. All right. So we go to F. Place the one with the rainstorm. And I need to get out of this thing, right? Because, like, holy fucking crud. This is annoying. Excuse me. This is going to
Let's get him fainted with meteorite. A good pilot can work with any mech. Sir, you have the metaphorical balls to shoot me with that thing. Dang, I am on a murder spree! Killer men, Doc. I don't want to discriminate. I eliminate. Let's go. Jack Rabbit. Ha! That was a pretty good shot. Oh, there's only four people remaining. Perfect shot. You're 
trying to challenge me. Only a few pilots are left, and I wonder. Ten what pilots will left. I took down four mechs and seven people. Let's see here. Who else I can take down before the night is up? Because the night is young. Okay, I see the speed gem, right? It's right over here. Wow. Oh, Speedy. Alright, I see the next gem over there. Baby, sweet mother of mercy. Let's take a picture. Click. Now that's a beautiful win. MVP. I got eleven wins underneath my belt. I only just started playing this game less than a week ago. Or two weeks ago, be exact. Not bad, not bad. One more game. Ah, Alpha Coin. Claim. More alpha coins, please. Thank you, thank you. Pilot. We're going to switch it back to ROM. Mission. Season challenges received. Today is another beautiful day, and I too am full of sunshine. Ah, uh, so juice, race on Rex. Harry, juice and Rex. Oh, wow, we're not even in the top three competitors right now. This is going to be interesting. Now, oh, these are the big ones here. A whole bunch of random numbers, too. Okay, so I hit shift, and it made me walk. Okay. No, I'm still learning the mechanics of this game. 
So this is interesting, right? Super tiny Robomecha, super tiny Robomecha, going burning hot. Robomecha! <laughs> Yeah, let's see here. Let's go somewhere different, right? Plaza stage uh, music rounds. I haven't been to the music rounds yet on this game. Let's go shopping. Okay, we got some defense modules. We got a speed module. Repair kit. Yes, please. Upgraded attack kit. You're gonna have to do more than that if you want me dead. Dang. The recoil on this assault rifle. You're blind spot, fella. You need to look out for that shit. How many people lived in London or died? Uh, let's see here. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, yeah, we're gonna replace the number one with the yeah, right.
Dang, he had some good crud. He had some of that Namekian and Kush on him. Let's freaking go. Love that shit. Get to this module right here and get a mech upgrade. A basketball all deformed car. All right, they had some. Sports up day. Oh my god, this cringy town we got. We're launching basketballs! I didn't know there was basketballs in other parts of the world, especially Japan. That's interesting. How many people did we kill? Only three? Feels like more than that. I'm already MVP, let's go! What was that? I got a Twitter alert, but I don't know what it was. Oh, I got a new subscriber. Hell yeah. I got new followers. Thank you so much. Like, I didn't see it. My alert box didn't pop up. It was supposed to. I will check the alert alerts here in a second. Holy crap, give me a few minutes. Like, obviously, I gotta get. I'm too big! I'm too chungy. Mmm, big chungy. Too chungy. <laughs> uh, with this mech, so uh, we'll be dropping the mech. Let's see here. Oh, Bun B I M. Thank you so much for or becoming an honorary cadet. I appreciate it. Bun B, thank you so much. Oh, not me. You just got pwned. Excuse me? Oh, there's a mech that way. We need a fast getaway. We're going with the blue mech.
Oh, this is awkward. Ooh, bounce pad. Hell yeah, bouncy, bouncy! Let's see here. After this round, I will check uh, what that notification was because I never got one of those before. Uh, it's quite interesting. But thank you for our Bumby -E I am for following me. I really appreciate it. Thank you for becoming an honorary cadet. I hope you can enjoy the live streams coming, of course. Uh, let's see here. Well, it's getting awfully lonely out in the wild yonder. You'll wonder if I'm gonna run into it. Down and out! Mm -mm -mm. Down for the account. Let's freaking go. Got a couple of droids over there. Roger, roger. Have you ever seen a Jedi before? Nope. Roger, roger. <laughs> Put in a repair kit. Oh. Now there's battle music. There's someone around. This way. Down and out. I'm sorry, Mega Man. I don't have time to play with you. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. You pesky little hedgehog. I don't have time to play with you either. Oh, I dropped goodies. I'll take all those goodies.
Seriously, the final oh, fight's gonna be out near the ocean? Oh, that's gonna be a pain. I ain't gonna lose this. Ah! Came in second place. I wasn't fast enough to heal. Ah! Oh well. Nice! Let's go to the main menu. Let's find out oh, what those uh, updates were. Because, like, holy crap, Twitch. Right. So, Bumby, thank you for obviously joining. Can't thank you enough. Like, holy crud. Like, I'm checking up on everything right now. Uh, it seems my cro crowd's coming from Twitter slash X. That's awesome. Now, it seems I pull more of a crowd from um, Twitter slash X than I do Twitch.tv. So, uh, I don't know if I'm going to continue streaming on Twitch. As a lot of my crowd comes from Twitter. Uh, but that was on Twitch.tv, and I want to say thank you so much, Bumby, for following. Being here, obviously, it's greatly appreciated. Well, let's see here. All right. So hopefully sometime tomorrow the next obviously uh C News Network will come out covering like uh VTuber development stuff like oh uh like new outfits like gamer news of course like hey, people to enjoy like new video game news and Obviously, we're going to be looking into, like, nice shot module. I really do like Neutron Star. Maybe I need to keep working and get more gold to get Neutron Star before it fades away.
because it's so cute. It's a cute little blue mech, and like it's really powerful too. Um, I do not have the stuff for that. So okay, cancel. Right. I do not have any money for that. Uh, I'm broke as a dog. I am broke as a dog without a bone. So yeah. Like, holy crud. So, let's see here. Sticking up on things. So, I want to mention, like, some goals right quick. And for, like, the YouTube channel, right? Because, like, goals are important. Like, I've never done goals before. Like, when I was a YouTuber, like, I've never done goals. Because I didn't, I wasn't getting anywhere, right? Like, ever since I became a VTuber, though, like, things have changed. In my first year, I want to start talking about progress. So, my first year of VTubing, you know, like, obviously doing all this. Which is your or Ori from? Uh, Yamato? Shimitsu. Why do they blacken the tubes and solar panels? Heat quicker. Got it! Okay, we got that one. Alright, how many players are on a team in, in a infantry arena? Uh, it, what did I say? Five? Oh, I got that one. Okay, that was lucky. Uh, other mech in an... In, 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 in a mecha league, what mech can you see? What uh, match can you see in a mecha? Eating competition, short slalom, uh, underground fight, marathon, underground fight? Oh, hell yeah! All right, I'll take that. I, I didn't even know there was an underground fight. Anything in this game? <laughs> right? So I want to talk about some goals. So if I hit over like a hundred and um, subscribers on my YouTube channel, like by the end of the year, because like I want to be honest, like I want to have something special by the end of the year. If I can get a hundred subscribers, there will be. A New Year's special, right? I will do a New Year's Day's uh, animation, special animation. I already got planned for New Year's Day, like, oh, talking about uh, a couple of things such as my next New Year's resolutions, right? As New Year's resolutions are important, it helps a person's development and growth as a human being. It also helps you keep in check. I want to talk about this year's New Year's resolutions, first of all, and what I have done so far. First of all, I got my own place, like I'm living in an apartment, and I'm actually doing a lot more better as I'm streaming now. I'm getting a lot more views, but I wouldn't say I'm a professional VTuber just yet. Uh, far from it, I'm afraid. I want to get better as a VTuber. So, New Year's resolutions. Becoming a better VTuber is definitely one of my goals. As this year, I started streaming after getting my own place. Another thing I want to cover that I have completed of sorts is making an image for myself. Uh, I think that was one of the year's resolutions. No, it wasn't. No, it wasn't. Um, getting my own place, getting a car, or uh, 
becoming a uh, like more successful VTuber. Uh, right, I can't remember it all, right? There's five New Year's resolutions. Um, finding Mrs. Right. All right, so I'm... I would like to say I'm halfway there at Finding Mrs. Right. Um, I hope Miss Laffy is watching, you know, like Laffy... Laffy or Laffy, like I cannot pronounce her... Uh, uh, Twitter tag, right? I hope she's doing okay. I hope she's all right. You know, like, a hey, she got caught up in that storm and everything. So, uh, getting on her way here. Like, so I'm halfway of my second New Year's resolution. Uh, my fifth one was trying to become a more better Yu-Gi-Oh! duelist. I've come to find out that I've hit a dry spell in Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, tabletop. So, like, I don't know if I'll be able to become King Games. I, uh, and I don't think I want to. Not on the tabletop scenario, anyways. So I'm going to be focusing more on Master Duel. Instead, I'm going to go with more of a virtual feel. Uh, for Yu-Gi-Oh! in the near future. I'm still going to play at my locals. I love playing at my locals. I love hanging out with my guy, my guy friends, you know, like... Um, and all that. So, yeah. Uh, so, King of Games is definitely, like, in the normal sense, out of the way. I'm going to become more of a digital King Games. So, like, for my new New Year's resolutions, I, I'm working them out. So, there's going to be a New Year's resolutions video. Um, so getting a place of my own is completed, like, obviously, making a name for myself as a VTuber. I, I guess I kind of made myself, I made a name for myself as a VTuber, not entirely, but uh, somewhat. Um, let's see here. Oh, right. And halfway of finding Mrs. Wright, so, oh, yay. I've got two and a half done, sort of. So I'm gonna have to focus on more New Year's resolutions in the near future. Um, let's see here. <sighs> like I'm gonna have to replace the uh, at least two of those. But as far as, like, if I get 100 subscribers on my U main uh, VOD channel, between my VOD and my animation channel, if I can get around 100 subscribers at Seed Next Gen Animations or Seed Next Gen VODs, like, I I'm going to be real. That's going to be epic between the two. If we can get 100, like, there will be a New Year's Resolutions, like, animation. There will also be that, if we can achieve that beforehand, though, like, between the two of them, we can achieve more, like, 100 before that, I will do a Christmas animation, right? Like a Christmas. I will do a Christmas animation. And that'll be fun, like, obviously. I want to see this done between my two channels on YouTube. Uh, I am not counting Twitter slash X, and I'm not counting the live streams. But let's just say, perhaps, like, if we meet halfway through the... Like, if we can get, like, 50 followers on Twitch... Uh, I, before the year ends, you know, all together... I would, uh... Like to do a giveaway if I can. I've talked about giveaways before. Sadly, I am... I don't have a lot of money. So, more than likely, this would be not a free giveaway. It would have to be, like, pay to play giveaway. And I'm going to have to choose the prizes carefully. Because, like, at my local game stores, like, they do have VTuber, like, um, like, statuettes. I've seen the, uh, chicken and v chicken girl VTuber, of course. Uh, I forget her name. She's the chicken queen. I've seen her figurine in my town. I've seen uh, several others. Uh, I've seen a figurine of Nanners float around, of course. Like, if I can 
like get some uh, backers on Twitch.tv, like doing donations and stuff. Like, I can put those in a giveaway. You know, get some people like uh, subscribing and paying donations. You know, like that'd be freaking awesome. I would love that. I would love to see that. It would help me out a lot. And the animations. And possibly get the giveaway off the ground. So, I would love to do a Christmas giveaway. If I can get 50 backers on Twitch. I mean, 50 followers and probably like 10 backers or like 10 subscribers. You know? And... Everything. Because the figurines themselves, like, cost somewhere around, like, I believe it was, like, 25 to 30 bucks for the statuettes at these stores. So, they're really cheap, but they're really good. They're made by uh, Pop Idol or something like that. I forget the name of the company. Uh, they make a lot of YouTuber, like, esque um, statuettes. I can get those and do those for a giveaway for Christmas. I want to stand out from other YouTubers. I want to do things my way, right? I want to do animations. I'm going to live stream. I just want to have a good atmosphere, but it's kind of hard to have a good atmosphere when you have all these problems. And some of these problems were caused of me doing drama content. Like, I'm not going to lie, it, it's done a number on me. It's done a number on me and my health. Hopefully, like, I could come back from this, right? Like, health-wise, my blood pressure is constantly spiking. Uh, as far as collabs, though, go, right? Because, like, some YouTubers are, like, paid to collab. Others are, like... Uh, you know, subscribe to collab. Others are just like contact to collab. There's really different types of different collaborations that can be done and shown. So, yeah. Uh, I will admit, it is really something else. I don't know if collabs are in my uh, sight right now. As a... As Still, I'm in my first year of streaming as a VTuber. I'm in my second year as a VTuber because I did like YouTube animations, it was animations, right? So yeah, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna admit, like I first started out with animations. So now that I'm streaming, I'm in my first year of streaming, and let me tell y'all, it is been stressful as. Are, I don't know so. so, in other words, I'm gonna continue to stream, of course. I'm gonna be a streamer. It's something that I want to do. It's something I love doing. I love playing games. I love reacting to content for all y'all. I like animating and everything. It's very important. As a person and as a content creator, if I'm gonna make it on this platform, I need to do the live stream. Um, there, after like YouTube and One One's live streaming services are completed, though, there will be something called mini e lessons, like VTuber mini lessons. There's already one on out how to talk to YouTubers. Uh, <laughs> Like, you see, like, my universal counterpart every time I get something wrong, I get shot. She shoots me with a machine gun. It's very funny. It's very classy. I love it. Uh, and then when, you, when I get it right, you hear Raven and sing from uh, Rayman 1 go. <laughs> Obviously, that means, yeah, I got it right. So... <sighs> um, in the long run, there's one more thing I want to talk about before closing the stream here tonight, and that's the condition of the Power World content. I'm going to wait until the Nintendo like case blows over, and if Power World's still going to be a thing. More likely, it's still going to be a thing, 
but they're going to have to like do a lot of changes. Not like real big changes. It's, uh, changes to the game for Nintendo no longer to be after. Uh, I've thought about a couple of things, right? I've thought about a couple of ideas for Power World to develop for the game. One of them is a wrist-mounted uh, power launcher, right? And like, instead of calling the uh, Power World uh, ball spears, uh, they go with capsules. Like, one thing Nintendo can't put a patent on is the name of capsules. So they go with more like a capsule thing. Like, I think it would be better off more like a, a pill capsule all type like design. If it were the pill capsule design, I truly believe. Oh, yeah, and this is like, I. This is the mech I want to get most of all in this game right now during like this thing, but I don't have the money for it. Uh, check this out. This is wicked as hell. I love this. All that glow, like that rainbow glow. I love rainbow, like it glows and colors. Like, oh, I want this mech so bad. It looks so rad, right? It looks so cool. I've got the Phoenix, right? But I don't have the mech to unlock it. Um, what I want most of all, the Ultra Beast Force Unit 4. But, uh, I get, <laughs> I get lost in my games, okay? So... Uh... Where the heck were we? Eh, it doesn't matter. So, as, as far as, like, me being a VTuber, it's not gonna change. Of course, like, you'll see certain design updates and changes, obviously, down the line as my uh, art style gets better. Like, what you see right here, right now, uh, is uh, a certain design feature, uh, a, a program feature with, like, the tracking I have right now. I really like it. The tracking is, like, with the hands is not really good, but it does what it does. Uh, Oh yeah, I was talking about a uh, VTuber mini episode. So the mini episode of How to Talk to VTubers was released a while back. So the mini uh, series episodes, like they're not gonna come out as fluently as VTuber 101, the like the thing, right? As I want to have these more spread out. As this teaches you, like, oh, how to communicate with certain VTubers or like. How to uh, show respect, and I think the next lesson is gonna be like how to get respect back, right? How do you get your favorite screen with respect back? This is gonna be a tricky one. Like this mini lesson, like to get their respect back, really falls on VTuber to VTuber. Uh, some of them like wait for a change in a person. Others wait for a huge donation. Some wait for a huge donation and then they change. It varies from streamer to streamer, VTuber to VTuber, you know? Like, it's really difficult to try to have this as a mini episode for redemption in VTubers. Like, a lot of VTubers do the court thing as well, right? Like, after they do, like, oh, like, you did a donation, you claim like, I want to be, be better for you, you're like, I want to support you more, I want to be in good graces. They put them through a court system type ordeal. Um, I'm more strict. As a VTuber, I'm more strict on this stuff. I don't want to like deal with it. Like if somebody attacked me before, I don't want to deal with it again from the same person. 
I'm different in that regard. If you screw up with me, you're gone. Like, when you mess up, you're gone. You ain't coming back. You're not in my good graces. You're gone. Uh, but as far as, like, other VTubers, it varies VTuber, VTuber, streamer, streamer, content, content creator. So this one's going to be one hell of a mini episode. Y'all going to look forward to that one coming out. Um... Uh, like, I don't know if it's gonna be today or tomorrow. I gotta get with the woman behind Ashi. I gotta get with Gio, obviously. We gotta get the voice acting and all this for, like, the uh, YouTuber 101 is. Uh, to finally get the next episode done. The scripting's done for it, and we need to get this thing out. Like, it's been over a month since YouTuber 101. Not YouTuber 101, but, um, like the uh, C News Network has returned with like news on YouTube and uh, It's really, really something. I want to say right now, uh, as a uh, VTuber myself, I'm beginning VTuber and animator, I will continue my hard work and be better at what I'm doing. Join Ashi as she's gonna be here tomorrow. Tomorrow, talking about VTuber 101 and how to defend yourself on Twitter. There is several different ways I'm gonna allow her to have access to my Twitter account for us to do so. And the final two last things is gonna be like, how do you make your first 3D model, and how do you? Or like not how do you make your first group? how do you make your tracking software? It's like YouTuber 101, what's the best tracking software for 3D models? I have had tons of experience with tracking software, depending on like which tracking software you go with and what's really your taste and flavor and what kind of cards you have to pay off the uh, service, right? So it really just Falls on like what you have and what you can do to the tracking server. I will mention right now for beginners like the Magic Mirror from obviously like right here now. I'll mention that for beginners. That is your go-to beginning like purchase like tracking software. It could be your first and it could be your last. It is very good. It's a one-time purchase. You download it, it's yours, you can get it off a of boot. It's it's very cheap, it's very affordable. It's like an American currency, it only costs you less than nine dollars, right? It is a very good software. So until next time, I have been Commander D. I hope you can look forward to the last three lessons of YouTuber 101 that'll be coming out as the series will come to its completion very soon of the live streams and the mini streams. Hey, Shadow, oh, Guga, hey, how's it going, pal? <laughs> Been a while. Yo to you too. So, uh, yeah, so, VTuber 101 is lessons like I said, are finally coming to the post. There's gonna be the mini episodes and so on and so forth. I will continue to obviously do other animations. <laughs> the live stream's coming to a uh, close, my friend. Sorry. Uh, the last few minutes are here. But, um,. So, yeah, I will mention, like, there's a lot of stuff that is on the horizon. Uh, the Ellie episode will be in development very soon. The scripting got done, of course. Now i got to create the Ellie model this weekend. Uh, the crime boss, a D-Lord model of her. It will not be for public release. I will not be releasing it publicly. Uh, of course, like, 
all these VTuber models you see in these animations that I make of other VTubers will never be released publicly. But if the VTuber gets in contact with me after the v after the animation or like the animations are a part of the models are part of are done, they demand, hey, can you like uh, you know sell me the models so I can keep it for myself, you know, for future reference? I'll be like, hell and yes, of course, like. I'm good like that, right? I'm okay with my work getting recognized and purchased by the big boys and girls. You know, I will give them the copy of the model and from then on out I will ask them permission if I can use it in future animations. But as far as collabs go right now, it is definitely not in the uh, deck. It's not in the club, right? So... It's, it's, it's a little sad. I hate to admit it, but I'm still green. I'm still new in the region of scene. I'll, uh, I will continue to, like, improve on my art style and presentation. And, like, holy crud! Uh, uh, okay, yeah, I'm still only have 24 followers. But, uh, yeah. There's a lot from behind the scenes that is getting done between me and my uh, allies, you know? And, uh, yeah, uh, Shadow Guga, thank you so much for showing up. Uh, you are an epic legend. To that, uh, Bun B, I am, I'm, like, thank you so much for becoming a, fol that, a follower as well. Um, I want to say that I want I know I shouldn't apologize for doing drama content, but it gets people noticed on YouTube. Like drama content is very popular. But I'm going to move on from it. And I'm gonna let other people handle it. I'm not very good at it. And I stink at it. So, uh, with that now mentioned, like, obviously, he, uh, despite um, the streams coming to a close, uh, join Ashi tomorrow for YouTuber 101 around, like, I I'm guessing around, like, uh, what time is it? Hold on, let me, let me double check, right? Right, okay, yeah. So she's gonna be around, uh, a 3 o'clock tomorrow? Uh, 3 p.m. U.S. Central Standard Time. Or C-E-S-T. As we are going, she's gonna be doing, uh, YouTuber 101. Uh, I'm stumbling on my words. It's not very good. I'm not looking hot right now. Uh, I need to get some sleep, and you know, I got other projects to complete. As far as my uh, one true love, Miss Long, yet hopefully she'll uh, be with me soon and be with all of us soon, right? be a part of the live streams and everything for all of us to enjoy as she's going to pick up the model of Rachel, old dragon storm, my fiance, and my lore. <laughs> um, she really likes the model, she really enjoys it. Um, I even have a wedding dress model made for Rachel. Y'all have recently seen, oh, the white tuxedo, oh, like, outfit for the you know, engagement slash marriage model. So, yeah, that's a thing I'm going to uh, love when she finally gets here for Rachel, with the, Ra the model of Rachel that she's going to be voicing to show off the wedding dress model. It's going to be something else. It is very special, it's very unique, it's very beautiful, extravagant, 
and glory. Oh, this is a glory. It's like one of the uh, like, uh, artists behind it is it, allowing it to be uh, sold for free or given away for free for a limited amount of time. I'm glad I was able to get that one in the mail. Uh, like tuxedo outfit. I'm gonna try to find a bouquet of like red roses for Rachel to hold and uh, everything. So, sadly, we, I'm still kicking this down the road, you know, for like time. But, uh, yeah, if I can get uh, all this stuff done, y'all can catch everything I mentioned in, like, the Rebound Replay here on Twitch.tv and on Twitter slash X for a while as I stream on both these pro programs. I will want to mention one last thing. I don't know how long I'm going to keep streaming on Twitch.tv. I may go to Kick because, like, the VTuber oppression by Twitch is atrocious. The uh, constant rules that are being spat that are suppressing VTuber expression is really, really upsetting. I'm seeing a lot of bad decisions made. So I don't know if I'm going to still stream with Twitter. I mean, Twitch.tv. I may go to Kick. Even though Kick is a kick in the pants. Um, at least it's easier to make it there and there's less oppressive rules. But I'm probably gonna still stream on Twitter slash X for the until the end of the year and talk unless I see some uh, even more horrible drastic issues made by uh, rules made by Twitch. I will either or say on Twitch if they don't make any more oppressive rules or they reverse them or like making it more fair for everyone right and as far as they keep making horrible decisions i just, i don't want to go to kick i i don't like kick a lot of scummy people are on kick and i like i just don't want to go to kick i don't want to go to kick I really don't but the way Twitter is right now, I uh, put not Twitter, but Twitch.tv, you know, like, I, I, I really don't care for it. I really don't care for all these oppressive rules they're coming up with just on VTubers alone. And they're not putting them against, like, livers, like, real life liver people. Because you see these people, like, you know, who mirror showing off their badonkadons and see their undies and all that kind of of, like you, you see what's underneath the wet bar does and you see like the uniform background is freaking atrocious I hate this and for some reason YouTubers are getting the worst of it because like kids kids watch YouTubers thinking they're cartoons and for kids they're not meant for kids they're meant for adults and Twitch I mean Twitter uh, Twitch thought to me doesn't get that right Twitch.tv doesn't get that YouTubers are made for adults to watch. Because adults have money. Kids don't have money. They don't donate. They don't subscribe with their own money. They don't have a job. They are incapable of doing that. And like a lot of countries or states. And it's because of that. Like they think they can just go. They think these kids can go to their parents you know, like wallet or purse and steal their credit card and pay everything off or like donate and like that's really disgusting of um, Twitter, I mean Twitch.tv to like uh, overall think that, you know, that's how things work. I don't think that's how they think it works, but at the same time, they're trying to market us for kids and it's really disgusting. It's really irresponsible of them too. And it's why I have the 18 years or older rule on my streams because I'm going to be real. I have that there because I don't want kids to watch my content and get the wrong idea, the bad idea, right? It obviously 
that's me being responsible, a responsible streamer and content creator. I like being responsible. I like being a good person. And this is why I'm moving on from drama content. Because, like, I'm just sick and tired of the drama. And it's raises my blood pressure to new levels. Um, I don't want kids watching my content. On my live streams, at least. Like, y'all can watch my YouTube content, you know, your kids or whatever. But, like, the live stream sitting over to the VOD channel, like, please don't. Please don't. That's for adults only. Uh, the animations are okay, right? But they're not exactly kid friendly. <sighs> like, I'm not a kid friendly content creator. I'm going to be real. I'm more of an adult only content creator, and rightfully so. I want to mention that hopefully things will get better from here on out since I'm moving on from drama. I want to succeed on this platform and right now the last thing I need to do is fail. So thank you one and all for watching of course, coming over the screen to Bundy, I thank you for calling. Shadow Guga, thank you for obviously watching here tonight. You know, like, thank you for coming back. I really appreciate it. And to everyone else on Twitter slash X that watch my live streams and hoping the best for, like, me and my content, from, like, all my artist friends to my, like, friend behind Austin, friend behind Geo, like, Joey Rimbo, my Dungeon Master, like, I've met so many wonderful people after getting out on my own and, and finally becoming human while also doing streaming and all that kind of stuff. It's really, really a good experience for someone like me. I was a shut in for years and it wasn't good for me. But being a YouTuber, having a life, let it be known, having a life while being a streamer and trying to make it, there's nothing ever wrong about that. There's nothing wrong with being a streamer and a good person while also living your own life. There's nothing wrong with that. There's never been anything wrong with that. So, this live stream comes to a place. I don't know what to say else, because like, I got work to do in the morning and like throughout the day, I got laundry to do uh, tomorrow, I've got a missus to prepare for, or obviously, I'm so glad that the volume is not under control. Like, if y'all didn't know, I was using a uh, Bluetooth microphone. Uh, the thing's like really old. And I'm going with a headset now, a Sonic the Hedgehog headset. Uh, for volume uh, control and even that, uh, other things. So, uh, yeah. I've also moved my setup into my bedroom. There, there is a video on Twitter slash X showing all oh, it's in my bedroom now. For better volume, for less echo, better off volume. So, thank you so much. I will see y'all on the next planet. I am so freaking tired. Good night, everyone. Or good morning or afternoon, wherever you are on Earth 13. In the Milky Way galaxy.